We are live here at A.D. Henderson University School where the last of the students here are being picked up. We just saw one dad go inside to get his daughter. We believe there's only about a handful of kids that are still here. Obviously a very good result to uh, the afternoon here as parents had some tense moments when they heard that students were here on campus and that there was an armed gunman just across the street at FAU's campus. 750 students were here for hours on lockdown for about two and a half hours while their parents actually had waited just off campus had to wait two and a half hours until that lockdown was lifted to come pick their students up. We can show you some of the video that we shot from about two hours ago when those parents were lining up to come pick up their students. Police were here to try to direct traffic and help those parents uh, come and collect their kids. Uh, but again, many of those parents telling us they were pleased with the way they were told about what happened. Many of them uh, receiving text messages and phone calls, letting them know that the school is on lockdown and that their kids were safe. Let's go ahead and listen in to what those parents had to say. Then I got worried when I actually knew that it was because, you know, Virginia Tech, you have so many different universities that these things happen. Someone goes crazy. Mm -hmm. So, you, yeah, you get worried. Absolutely. I mean, it's kind of scary thinking somebody's walking around with a gun and you don't know where they are, who they are. But it seems like it went pretty well. So again, A.D. Henderson, which is a K-12 through school, was on lockdown, as well as a daycare that's right next door. Uh, all of those students pretty much being picked up already today, maybe only a couple left. We did try to effort, effort an interview with one of the administrators here on campus, but they went ahead and um, told us we had to talk to the College of Education, which then explained to us that we had to speak with media relations at FAU. But just wanted to let you know we're trying every which way to get as much information for you here on campus. For now, we're live. I'm Marissa Bag, WPTV News Channel 5.